what's happening guys welcome back to another episode on diy ranch where everything is diy i'm out here today at the ranch beautiful slightly overcast day i'm doing a quick little fun episode today it's going to be a diy back scratcher for our cows they got some flies out here they're kind of unhappy about it so over on their hut which is right down there uh we're going to be installing a uh custom back scratcher uh, made from floor brushes so come along let's check it out all right guys so today i'm going to be working inside our shed shop here this is a 12 by 24 custom shop pretty nice built this with my father-in-law they were going to be using these brushes from lowe's they're almost nine and a half inches long i got three of them at about five dollars a piece I'm uh, going to be using some scrap 2x4. I got some 2.5 inch uh, torque screws. I got my cordless saw as well as impact driver. And uh, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be making a back scratcher for the cows. So stay tuned and see what comes of it. All right, so the first step here is to take our three brushes. We're going to lay them out. We're going to measure the total distance here. We know how long to cut our first board. Looking at 27, 27 inches. Take our two by four and use all the room that we don't have here. And take our two by four and measure out 27 inches and then cut it straight. My trusty carpenter square here. Cut it here. Let me draw a little diagram so I can better explain what's going on here. So we already have the post of the uh, cow hut, which is out in the field. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to mount this uh, horizontal piece with the brushes on it, and one, two, three brushes. And then we're going to have a uh, angled piece come up here. We're going to have a vertical piece here so it can all bolt on as one strong unit. And this uh, angle piece will prevent this board from breaking when the cows inevitably push up on it. Uh, if all goes according to plan. We've just cut our bottom piece. Now we need to cut uh, our angle brace. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a 45 on the bottom of this. Got my 45 cut. I'm sure there is a uh, Pythagorean theorem we can use to figure this out, but I'd rather make it hard. So an easy way to figure this out without doing math is you'll get your vertical piece mounted here, and then you'll take your cross member and you line it up and scribe where you need to put your other 45. I think that's about good. This isn't rocket science, people. This is uh, just a quick, effective DIY to make a cow's back scratcher. So now we've got our bottom 45, we've got our top 45, and we have our horizontal brace. So the last thing I want to do is line this all up. Looks good, looks good. And then I'm just going to scribe a line just at the top of the horizontal brace because we got a little extra there. Put this back to our zero cut. We'll cut this excess off. And voila. Uh, get my impact. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do, just start, start my, uh, my screws. And take my vertical piece and attach it to my horizontal piece like so. Okay. Now 
now that that is in place, I want to take my cross support, line it up again. What I'm going to do is I'm going to drill, uh, I'm going to send a couple screws in from both directions. but not least the bottom part all right so now that my frame is all done the last step before we install is to attach our brushes onto the base so what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to take the screws and drive them upwards into the uh, 2x4 because, of course, I don't want the screws sticking out and hurting the cows. So now just a quick overview. I've got my three brushes mounted to the horizontal piece. I've got my brace with 45s on each side and I have my, my vertical piece mounted. So when we get over to the um, cow pen, we'll just throw some screws into the four by four that already is standing. Determining a good height to mount this can be a little bit tricky. So what I've done is I've brought some grain with me and that should entice the girls to follow me over. And then I can uh, kind of judge it by eye how, how high to put this up. All right, so I've got a little bit of grain for them. Just kind of want to see where on the pen the cow's backs come up to. Bounty is, I think, nine months, eight months old. And Blondie is coming up on a year in July. So you can see probably a few inches off this top board will be plenty and uh, they can make it work. Alrighty folks, there you have it. Thank you guys for joining me on another episode of DIY Ranch. I really hope you enjoyed this uh, little DIY back scratcher I did right here, just as some scrap material. Uh, if you did like the video, please hit that like button, subscribe, I encourage everybody to do so if you haven't yet. Say goodbye to Brownie and Blondie, say goodbye to the ranch, have a great day.